Hello, this is Mrs. Noons. Today we're going to be reading aloud from the New Bedford Public Schools Grade 1 Reading Packet Number 2. I'm going to be doing Lesson 3 of Part 2. And we are going to be reading aloud How Coney Island Came Back by Micah Gordon. And then I'm going to be going over the comprehension questions. How Coney Island Came Back by Micah Gordon. Welcome to Coney Island. Coney Island is a part of New York City. It was a very popular place more than 100 years ago. Back then, people loved to visit Coney Island's amusement parks. They really loved one called Luna Park. Luna Park, Dreamland, Coney Island, New York City. A map of Coney Island over 100 years ago. A man named William H. Reynolds made plans for a new park. He would build it near Luna Park. Reynolds wanted his park to be better than Luna Park. He called his park Dreamland. Luna Park over a hundred years ago. Building Dreamland. William Reynolds copied Luna Park's rides, but he made his rides bigger and better. Luna Park had a boat ride. Reynolds made a bigger boat ride at Dreamland. Two boats raced down a steep ramp and into the ocean. Shoot the Chutes Boat Ride at Dreamland. Reynolds copied the buildings in Luna Park too. Luna Park had a tall tower in the park center. Dreamland had a taller tower. People could see the tower lights from miles away. Dreamland opened. It cost 15 cents to enter. People loved it. Huge crowds visited all summer. It was, a pop it was as popular as Luna Park. The Dreamland Tower. The Roaring Fire. Dreamland was a fun place. It was popular for seven years. Then something terrible happened. Workers were using hot tar to fix a ride. A fire started. People think some hot tar spilled and started the fire. The Fire at Dreamland. It says Coney Island's Big fire disaster. Panoramic view of the ruins of burned district. Most of dreamland was made of wood. It burned fast. Hundreds of firefighters came, but they could not save dreamland. All the rides burned down. The tall tower collapsed. No one was killed but Dreamland was destroyed. Luna Park stayed in business for many more years. Then a big fire destroyed it too. Firefighters putting out the Dreamland fire. Coney Island today. There are other amusement parks at Coney Island after Dreamland and Luna Park. There is even another Luna Park at Coney Island today, and people still love to go there and have fun. The new Luna Park on Coney Island. Okay, now we're going to go into our comprehension questions. As always, remember to look back in your text to help you find the answers. So we're going to start with question one from page one of the passage. Why was Coney Island popular more than 100 years ago? A, it was an old place. B, it was part of a big city. C, it had amusement parks. So again, why was Coney Island popular more than 100 years ago? 
question two from page two of our passage. What was the new park called? Complete the sentence. The name of the new park was blank. A, Dreamland. B, Reynolds. C, Luna Park. The name of the new park was Dreamland. The name of the new park was Reynolds. The name of the new park was Luna Park. Question three from page three of the passage. How did Reynolds make the rides at Dreamland different from the rides at Luna Park? A, Reynolds made his rides bigger. B, Reynolds made his, his rides wetter. C, Reynolds made his ride slower. Question four from page four of the passage. What happened after Dreamland opened? A, tickets cost $50 at Dreamland. People loved Luna Park more than Dreamland. Crowds of people went to Dreamland. Remember to go back in and find your answers. What happened after Dreamland opened? A, ticket cost $50 at Dreamland. B, people loved Luna Park more than Dreamland. C, crowds of people went to Dreamland. Question from page five of the passage. What was the cause of the fire at Dreamland? So use the pictures to help you. What was the cause of the fire at Dreamland? Question six from page six of the passage. Why did Dreamland burn so quickly? A, it was too hard for the fire to reach. B, it had rides in buildings made of wood. C, it had a big tower that collapsed. And question seven from page six of this passage. Think about what happened at Coney Island over the years. What is happening today? So again, look back. A, people visit Dreamland on Coney Island now. B, Coney Island is still a fun and popular place. C, there are no amusement parks on Coney Island. So again, think about what happened at Coney Island over the years. What is happening? To A, people visit Dreamland on Coney Island now. B, Coney Island is still a fun and popular place. C, there are no amusement parks on Coney Island. Excellent job. As always, I challenge you to go back and reread this passage on your own and to go over your comprehension questions, making sure you're finding your answers in the text. See you soon.